Um, first thing I learned about Ginghamsburg was um, was the work they were doing in Darfur, and um, I didn't see any other churches that invested across the world. Ginghamsburg serves as an example to inspire more change, so it's not just what you do here and the people that are directly affected by your ministries both here and abroad, but it's the fact that you are influencing other people and other churches um, in serving the kingdom of God so that what you do doesn't just add, but it multiplies. You've changed me, and I thank you for that. I'm a young pastor in South Carolina. I'm a mom and a wife and um, very busy in ministry, and I've been so inspired this week. So thank you, Ginghamsburg, for blessing me. Kim Miller, one of the saints of your church, um, came up and worked with uh, some of the key leaders in our church and designed a plan for how we could redesign our worship space. Um, and now we're moving forward with that, and this Easter we'll be celebrating in our new space. Um, and so it has made a huge difference in how we're changing lives and making disciples in Lakewood, Ohio. This is the first time I've really been able to catch on to what's going on here. And it's mind-blowing. It's heart-blowing. And uh, I'm going to take that back to Lincoln, Nebraska. And we're going to do something about that. I'm, I'm in a young church, a lot of potential. And I think we can, we can do this. I work with a lot of young people. And I didn't know what to expect when uh, I got here to Ginghamsburg. Uh, but what I can tell you is after being here for just uh, two days uh, that when I go home there are going to be a lot of young people in Atlanta, Georgia that are going to be way more focused on the mission of our church than they were before. I see games are changing the world by investing in building other leaders. No one has put time into me the way the folks at Ginghamsburg have. Uh, I come all the way from Atlantic City, New Jersey, and the things I'm learning here is going to make me a better husband, uh, going to make me a better father. Coming here and seeing that it's possible and seeing how you're making an impact and a difference in the world around you just inspires me and, and really drives that passion that I have for going back and changing the world for Jesus Christ where I'm going to be serving. I've loved seeing how the multi-sites and the different ministries each allow something to flourish in a specific context and use people to use their gifts and passions to change the world. You know when Mike shares stories like, hey I don't even know the ministries that are going on here, I didn't create this, it's the organic ministries of people saying yes to God. I think that's uh, pretty powerful and I see that's how uh, Ginghamsburg is uh, not only just changing this area but changing the world. Every time uh, that you give, every time that you give, a give of your gifts, your talents, and your resources, uh, you are literally changing people's lives. So I thank you for investing in me, uh, investing in my family, and, in, and investing in the people that God has called me to serve.